Welcome back to Musical Theater at Milton. Well, I should say live musical theater, right? Because for the past two years, we've been doing Zoom musicals. And I have a question. So raise your hand if you remember the first time you ever saw Frozen. Yeah, exactly. So that was back in probably 2010 or something like that. And I don't think that we realized back when we saw Frozen back then how resonant and meaningful the musical would be after what we've been through the past couple of years, right? So the themes of isolation and closing the gates, right? We really know what that means on a whole new level. And I think during those Zoom musicals that we did, really the thing we missed most of all was you. Right? You were what was missing. That we missed your reactions, we missed your applause, we missed your laughter, we missed the flowers afterwards, we missed the whole thing, we missed our audience. And so welcome back, we are so happy to have you here. And so, without further ado, the cast and crew present Frozen Junior.
All right, my loves, it's time for bed. That means actually sleeping, okay? No magic. Yawn, I love sleeping. Good night. Good night. Good night. They're gone. It's just us. Snowman, snowman, snowman! We're supposed to be sleeping. But the sky's awake, so I'm awake, so we have to play. Okay. Okay. You know, there's a recipe to making a proper snowman. Really? Uh-huh. A little bit of you, a little bit of me, a part that loves to dream. A part that sings from a tree, a little like me, a little like you. A part that's nice, a part that's naughty too. A loyal friend who is there no matter what. With a big round belly and a big bouncy butt. He'll love warm hugs and the bright sunlight. And he'll really love the summer. But he'll melt. Yeah, you're right. So we'll build him back together. Yes, together, that's the key. Cause he's a little bit of you and me. What do we call him? Um, Olaf! Hi, I'm Olaf and I like warm I love you, Olaf! Okay, time for bed. No, time for more magic. Anna, you know I'm not supposed to. But your to. magic is the most beautiful, wonderful, perfectful thing in the whole wide world. Okay. Ma. Ma, 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 la 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 A little bit of you, a little bit of me. You do the magic and I get to see. A little bit of little fun. A little bit of fun in the middle of the a night. A little bit of magic and it all takes flight. Ow, my head. Anna, Mama, Papa, wake up, Anna. Please help. Anna. Elsa, what have you done? I didn't mean it. Her skin is ice. We need the hidden folk of the mountains. They have healing powers. Yes, the hidden folk. Call out for them quickly. Kidabawata. I'm a child of the northern nomads. And now you're a queen? Good for you. Please, our daughter is hurt. This is a magic strike. I'm sorry, it was an accident. Born with the powers or cursed? Born, and they're getting stronger. You're lucky she didn't strike her heart. A heart's not so easily changed. The head may be persuaded. I'm removing all magic, even the magic that puts your memories, to be safe. She'll be all right. Thank you. Remove my magic too, please. I'm sorry, little snow. That I can't do. Your powers are a part of you. But I'm afraid of what I'll do. Then fear will be your enemy. Your fear will cause dangerous ice and snow beyond your control. We won't let that happen. We'll protect her. OK. I must leave you now, but I bid you out. Call me anytime. I love children. Raised a few strays myself. Farewell, and thank you. She can learn to control it, I'm sure. Elsa, here. Wear these gloves. See if they can help you keep it inside. We'll close the gates, limit her contact with people, and keep her powers hidden from everyone, including Anna. What? We can't keep them separated. They're sisters. Yes. That, this is how it has to be. It's best for Anna. Mommy? What only, happened? Only until we get more answers. Yes. We'll find our way back to be a family again.
It's snowing, Elsa! Do you want to build a snowman? Come on, let's go and play. I never see you anymore. Come out the door. It's like you've gone away. We used to be best buddies. And now we're not. I wish you would tell me why. Do you want to build a snowman? It doesn't have to be a snowman. Go away, Anna. Okay, bye. I'm doing everything you said. The gloves are helping. Good. Now again. Conceal it, don't feel it. Don't, don't let, let it show. show. I've started talking to the pictures on the walls. Hang in there, Joan. It gets a little lonely. All these empty rooms, just watching the hours tick by. Yeah. I've been hiding my powers for years, but I'm so afraid. They're getting stronger. Come here, my poor child. No, don't touch me. I don't want to hurt you. Conceal it, don't feel it. Conceal it, don't feel it. Anna, it's time for us to leave. We'll only be gone a couple of weeks, my sunshine. Please, do you have to go? Yes. There are answers out there, Elsa, to help you, to help all of us. I can't do this here on my own. You can and you must. We're proud of you. I'll try not to let you down, Father. Tragic. As Bishop of Arendelle, I proclaim we shall honor the ways until young Queen Elsa becomes of age. May they rest in peace. Those poor daughters, all alone. People are asking, where you been? They say of courage, and I'm trying to. I'm right out here for you. Just let me in. We have each other, it's just you and me. What are we gonna do? Do you wanna build a snowman? Day. Queen Elsa has come of age. I can't believe they're finally opening up the gates. And for a whole day. It's coronation day. Haha. <laughs> Princess Anna. The window is open, so's that door. I didn't know they did that anymore. Who knew we owned a thousand salad plates? For you guys, I remember these empty halls. Why have a ballroom with no balls? Finally, they're opening up the gates. They'll be actual real life people. It'll be totally strange. But wow, am I so ready for this change? For the first time in forever, there'll be music, there'll be light. For the first time in forever, I'll be dancing through. If I'm elated or gassy, but I'm somewhere in that zone. For the first time in forever, I won't be alone. I can't.
can't wait to meet everyone. What if I meet the one? Tonight, imagine me gowned in all, fetchingly draped against the wall, the picture of sophisticated race. I suddenly see him standing there, a beautiful stranger, tall and rare. I want to stuff some chocolate in my face. But then we laugh and talk all evening, which, which is, is totally bizarre. Nothing like the life I've led so far. For the first time in forever, there'll be magic, there'll be fun. For the first time in forever, I could be noticed by someone. And I know that it's totally crazy to dream I'd find romance. For the first time in At least I've got a chance. Don't let them in, don't let them see. Be the good girl you always have to be. Don't see you, you don't feel. Put on a show, make one wrong move, and everyone will. But it's only for today. It's only for today. It's agony to wait. It's agony to wait. Tell the gods to open up the gate. The gate. The gate. For the first time. Shot outside. For the first time. Sorry. It's perfectly fine. Hi. Hi. Whoa, reindeer in the castle. Come on, Sven. Let's go. Eyes, nice, fresh eyes. Goodness, that was awkward. Not that you're awkward, but just because we're. I'm awkward. You're gorgeous. Wait, what? Prince Hans of the Southern Isles. Oh, Princess Anna of Arendelle. Princess? My lady. Oh, no. You don't have to do that. I'm not that princess. No, my sister Elsa's the queen. I'm just me. Just you? I mean, I'm not the heir. I'm just the spare. <sighs> Forget it. I'm not making any sense. How embarrassing. You don't have to be embarrassed around me. I'm just the 13th son of a king of a very small kingdom. Please accept my humblest of apologies. Of course, Hans of the Southern Isles. Thank you, Anna of Arendelle. Oh my goodness, the coronation. I have to go. Will I see you later? Definitely. Queen anointed. Queen. Trying every day with all I do and do not say here at the edge of the abyss, knowing everything my whole life has led to this. I wish I could tell the truth, show you who's behind the door. I wish you knew. Imagine she was for I have 
have to be so cautious and you're so extremely different you and me and it's dangerous to dream seal to feel and seal to feel Stop smiling, how strange Does that mean that things are different? Could they really change? I can't be what you expect of me And I'm not what I say But I would love to know you Is it dangerous to dream? You look so grown up and beautiful. Thank you. You look beautifuler. Thank you. It's been so many years. I'd forgotten what a party felt like. Yeah, it's warmer than I remember as a kid. And what's that amazing smell? Chocolate. Chocolate. Your Majesty, may I present the Duke of Weaseltown. Weaseltown. Duke of Weaseltown. Your Majesty. As your most profitable trading partner, it's about time we met face to face. And what a lovely face you have. Oh! With some queens, what you get is what you get. But you are a model queen. Thank you? Might I tempt you with my... Tango? I... Buck, 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 buck. I don't dance. Don't worry. I'll lead you. What she means is she can't dance. She's terrible. I wouldn't want you losing a toe. I've never heard of a queen who can't dance. Well, I've heard what you get is what you get. Oh, hmm. that's cool. There's something seriously wrong with those two. Thank you. You are a model princess. <laughs> How kind of you. I take after my sister. Thank you. This is nice, Elsa. Us talking. It really is, Anna. Maybe we could do it more often. I'd really like that. And maybe we could keep the gates open, let some life back in the castle. Wait. No, 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 no. We, we can't do that. Can't we? Who's stopping us? You're the queen, and you can do whatever you want. Well, then I'm stopping us. But why? I don't understand. That's right. You don't. May excuse me for a minute? Elsa. Hello again. Hans? You look upset. Are you okay? Long story. Elsa just left me alone again, like she did for years. I'm so sorry. It's okay. I'm used to it. She stopped talking to me when we were little. But why would she do that? I don't know. I can never understand what I did. I was alone a lot as a kid, too. But you have 12 older brothers. Yeah, but if they weren't humiliating me, they were ignoring me. It's not going to be like that when I have a family. Me neither. No one will ever be shut out. Oh, Anna, I could never shut you out. OK, can I just say something crazy? I love crazy. All my life has been a series of doors in my face. And then suddenly I bump into you. I was thinking the same thing. Because like I've been searching my whole life to find my own place. And maybe it's the party talking or the chocolate fondue. But with you, but with you, I found my place. I see your face, and, and it's, it's nothing like I've ever known before. Love is an open door. Love is an open door. Love is an open door. 
with you, with you, with you, with you. Love is an open door. I mean, it's crazy. What? We finish each other's sandwiches. That's what I was gonna say. I never met someone who thinks so much like me. Jinx, jinx again. Our mental synchronization can have but one explanation. You and I were just meant to be. Say goodbye, Say goodbye to the pain of the past. We don't have to feel it anymore. Love is an open door. Love is an open door. Life can be so much more with you, with you, with you, with you. Love is an open door. Okay, can I say something crazy? Will you marry me? Can I say something even crazier? Yes. Love is an open. Love is an open door. <laughs> Elsa, we have something to tell you. I mean, your majesty. Prince Hans and I would like your blessing of our, our marriage. marriage. Marriage? Yes. May I speak with you alone, please, Anna? No. Whatever you have to say to me, you can say to the both of us. All right. You can't marry a man you just met. You can, if it's true love. And what do you know about true love? What do you know about me? You asked me for my blessing, but my answer is no. The party's over. Close the gates. What? Elsa, no. No, wait. Give me my glove. What did I ever do to Enough. you? Enough. Why? Why do you shut me out? Why do you shut the world out? Why are you so I afraid said enough! Of? I... I didn't... I didn't mean it. I'm sorry. I... How can this be? Elsa! Don't come near me. Monster! She's a monster! Stay away. Stay away from me! I'm going after her. It's dangerous. I'll go with you. No, I need you here to take care of Arendelle. On my honor. I leave Prince Hans in charge. Wait, I don't want you getting hurt. How do you know you can trust her? Because she's my sister. Yeah, what do they have against reindeer? I don't know. Rain, reindeer are better than people. Sven, don't you think that's true? Yeah, people defeat you and curse you and cheat you. Every one of them is bad, except you. Thanks, buddy. But people smell better than reindeer. Sven, don't you think I'm right? That's once again true, for all except you. You got me, let's call it a night. Good night. Don't let the frost bite bite. Nice to what? Hey. Aren't you the princess of Arendelle? Yes, I am. Do I know you? The name's Kristoff, and I'm an ice harvester. I mean, a recently unemployed ice harvester. What are you doing out here? I'm looking for my sister. The one that went all ice crazy and ruined my business? Yes, but see, it was my fault. I got engaged to Prince Hans, and then Elsa freaked out because I only just met him, you know, today. Wait, you got engaged to someone you just met? Yes. Why is everyone so caught up on that? I've got good instincts. Hmm. I wouldn't go that way if I were you. What do you think, Sven? Uh, I think she's gonna die on her own. We 
should help her. I would offer to help her, but I don't think she'd take it. Wait, how can you help me? Well, the storm is coming from the North Mountain, which, I'm which is where I'm guessing you'll find your sister. And I know how to get up there without dying. Okay, Kristoff, you're hired, let's go. So, did you know your sister could do this? I didn't know anything. You know, most people who disappear into the mountains want to be left alone. Nobody wants to be alone. A little bit of you, a little bit of me. Ah! Ah! Okay, let's start things over. Hi, everyone. I'm Olaf, and I like warm hugs. Olaf? Yeah, huh? Olaf. Like I said, yeah, huh? And who's the funky looking donkey? Oh, that's Ben. Aha. Uh -huh. And who's the reindeer? Sven? Ah, uh, they're both Sven. Makes it easier for me. And you're Anna. How do you know my name? Because you gave me my big, bouncy But <laughs> That's right. Don't you remember? I think I'm starting to. I'm a little bit of you and a little bit of... Elsa! Olaf, did Elsa build you? Yeah, why? Do you know where she is? Yeah, why? Do you think you could show us the way? Yeah. Why? I'll tell you why. We need Elsa to bring back Summer. <gasps> summer? Oh, I don't know why, but I've always loved the idea of sun and summer and all things hot. Really? I'm guessing you don't have much experience with heat. Nope. But sometimes I like to close my eyes and imagine what it'll be like when summer does come. Bees a buzz, kids will blow dandelion fuzz, and I'll be doing whatever snow does in summer. A drink in my hand, my snow up against the burning sand, probably getting gorgeously tanned in summer. I'll finally see a summer breeze blow away a winter storm, and find out what happens to solid water when it gets warm. And I can't wait to see what my buddies all think of me. Just imagine how much cooler I'll be in summer. Da 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 do da 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 do. The hot and the cold are both so intense. Put them together, it just makes sense. Da 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 da. Winter's a good time to stay in and cuddle, but put me in summer and I'll be a happy snowman. Relaxing in the summer sun, just letting off steam. <sighs> oh, the sky will be blue, and you guys will be there too. When I finally do what frozen things do in summer. I'm gonna say something. Don't you dare. In, in summer. What are we going to do when we find your sister? What's your plan? I'm going to talk to her. Talk to her? That's not a plan. Sure it is. Let's keep moving. <laughs> Yo ho, big summer blowout. Oh, hello, man. Hello, lady. Hello, reindeer. Hello, little one in snowman costume. Oh, hello. Who are you? I'm Wandering Oaken from Wandering Oaken's Trading Post in Sona. In this is my family. Yo! Yo! And today is lucky for you. We are offering big summer blowout sale. Look, Sven, set after half off. Also, short shorts and open toed foot clogs. And a sun bomb of my own invention. Oh, well, that's very nice, but. Shouldn't you guys be at home instead of out in the storm? Yeah, what's with all the cheer? And why are we not scared of the notion of eternal winter? You're asking me with your eyes? Because of Hige. Hige? Hige? What's Hige? 
Iga. Iga is the word my family lives by. I hope you understand. Iga means comfortable. Iga means cozy. Iga means sitting by the fire with your cheeks all rosy. Higa 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 I will tell you more. But it's freezing and I'm not feeling very higa right now. Which is exactly why you should make a stop at Poke and Sada. Extended hours for the storm. Wait, what are you doing? Giving her exactly what she is needing. Higa. Higa means easy. Higa means all together playing how you say. <laughs> Finding a spider in your shoe. Not Higa. Not Higa. Higa's not scheduled. You can't say when it starts or ends. Most importantly, it can't be Higa without your family and friends. Higa, 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 not Higa. A future that's cold and dead and bleak. Not, Not Higa. He's right. We have to go. We have an urgent job to do. If you can't come back with us to Higa, take all the Higa that you can with you. Oh, Higa, 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 Higa. Bye-bye. Wow. Look, you can see Arendelle from here. When I left, it was just flurries. And now, it's completely frozen. But it's okay. Elsa will thaw it. Will she? You have no idea what your sister is capable of, do you? No. Come on. of isolation and it looks like I'm the queen the wind is howling like this swirling storm inside couldn't keep it in heaven knows I've tried don't let them in don't let them see be the good girl you always have to be don't feel, don't let them know Well, now they know Let it go, let it go Can't hold it back anymore Let it go, let it go Turn away and slam the door I don't care what they're going to let the storm rage on The cold never bothered me anyway It's 
It's funny how some distance makes everything seem small And the fears that once controlled me can't get to me at all It's time to see what I can do to test the limits and break through No right, no wrong, no rules for me I am free stand idly by in Arendelle. Prince Hans, the temperature is dropping. The queen has cursed this land. Out here, we'll be lucky to survive the night. Then climb faster, Wiselton. Anna, Princess Anna, she's been gone too long. We have to find her. But what of the cold? But what of the queen? Do you think the queen means to hurt us? Of course she does. She is a monster, and I bet Princess Anna is in on it too. Please, what the queen's motivations are, I cannot say. But I can assure you, Anna is pure and noble. Why should we listen to you? Yeah! Because I am the prince who is in charge of Arendelle. And I will not hesitate to protect it from treason. Treason? Princess Anna did leave Prince Hans in charge. We're lucky he came along in our time of need. Look, I see a castle in the distance. Made of ice! The queen! Follow me, everyone. If the queen, queen really is a monster, then she will be dealt with. And Anna and I will lead you back summer. Whoa, now this is ice. Maybe I should talk to Elsa alone. Last time I introduced her to a boy, she kind of froze everything. But it's a palace made of ice. Ice is my life. Bye, Sven. Darn. Uh, you too, Olaf. Just give us a minute. Uh, OK. One, two, three. Elsa. It's me, Anna. Elsa. Anna! I'm so happy to see you! Elsa, this place is incredible! Thank you. I never knew I could create something like this! I I'm so sorry about what happened. No, you don't have to apologize. It wasn't your fault. You didn't know. Did mother and father know? Yes. Then why didn't I know? For your own safety, Anna! 
I nearly killed you with my magic. You were six years old. I'm not a child anymore, Elsa. Neither am I. And my powers are much stronger than they were. You should probably go now, please. Well, I don't want to let you go. I'm trying to protect you. You don't need to protect me. I'm not afraid. Anna, go back to Arendelle. Um, you kind of set off an eternal winter in Arendelle. Actually, everywhere. Everywhere? But it's okay. You can just unfreeze it. No, I can't. I don't know how. Sure you can. I know you can. I'll help you. For the first time oh, in forever, oh, I'm such a fool. I can't be to be afraid. No we can work me. this out together. I'm okay. I'm fine. Who are you? This is Kristoff. He helped me up the mountain. Then help her get home safely, please. Now go! down the mountain. I guess you were right. She does want to be left alone. But what about Arendelle? Well, I can't go back there with the weather like this, and then there's Kristoff's ice I'm business. I'm not worried about my ice business. You're not? No, I'm worried about you. Your sister struck you with her powers. I know some friends who can help. You have friends who aren't reindeer? Hey. Yes, I have friends. Actually, they're more like family. They took Sven and me in, and we had no one. And they're healers. I'll call them. Run! I'll protect you! It's been a short life, but a good one. Not a couple. I'm just helping her. Not a couple. Are you absolutely sure about yes. that? Yes. Yeah, definitely not a couple. Then what's the issue? Is it the grumpy way he talks? Come on. Or the clumpy way he walks? We need your help. Wait, what? <laughs> And though we know he washes well, he always ends up sort of smelly. Sensitive and sweet. Listen! So he's a bit of a fixer-upper. So he's odd a few flaws. Like his peculiar reindeer suit with a reindeer that's a little outside of nature's laws. So he's a bit of a fixer-upper, but this is certain enough. You can fix this fixer-upper up with a little really change. We're only saying a lot of force that's powerful and strange. People make bad choices if they're mad or scared or stressed. But throw a little love their way. Throw a little love their way. And you'll bring out their best. True love brings out the best. Everyone's a bit of a fixer-upper. That's what it's all about. Father, sister, brother, we need each other to raise us up and round us. The only fixer upper fixer that can fix a fixer upper is true, 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 love, true, love, love, true, love, true, love, love, true. Where's the 
this another magic strike? Why did you not tell us? I tried. Anna, there's ice in your heart. Put there by your sister. If not removed swiftly, the solid ice you will freeze forever. So remove it. If it was her head, we could. But a heart does not so easily let go of its pain. Only an act of true love can thaw a frozen heart. An act of true love? Anna, we've got to get you back to Hans. Hans. But you don't have much time. Yes, move swiftly, Kristoff. Her life depends on it. Thank you. It's fine, Olaf. Let's go. Olaf, stay close. No time to explain you. Bye. Okay. Bye. Goodbye. Bye. Be careful. <laughs> to Arendelle. So, what do we do with this monster? I'm not a monster. I surrender. Take me to Princess Anna. No, take her to trial. That's enough, Weasel Town. Wesselton! My name is Wes Oton, and it's not enough. It's getting colder by the minute. Look at the queen, even she shivers. I'm not cold. Take her inside to the guards until I decide what to do with her. Help! Please help! Anna, you've returned. Yes, and she's freezing. Her life is in danger. I'll take her from here. Please, keep her warm. Not so fast, Kristoff. What? She's safe inside the castle now. You can't leave. Stop it, Sven. No, why are you letting her go? Because it's the right thing to do. I think. No, come on. Hans! Oh, Hans! I also froze my heart, and now only an act of true love can save me. Oh, Anna. If only there was someone out there who loved you. But I thought you said you did. I lied. As 13th in line, I knew I'd have to marry into the throne, and you were the obvious target. Who knew Elsa would make it so easy for me? What? You two doomed each other and made me the hero who just tried to help. No. And now, once I tell everyone we're married and get rid of Elsa, then I'm King Hans of Arendelle. What? You won't get away with this. You're no match for Elsa. I already have. No, no, no! You can't leave me locked in this cold room to die. Please. I thought this was true love. Olaf. How did you get in here? I picked the lock with my carrot nose. Turns out it's cute and useful. Oh, Olaf. Where's Hans? What happened to your act of true love? I was wrong about him. It wasn't true love. I don't even know what love is. That's all right. I do. Love is putting someone else's needs before your own. Like how Kristoff brought you here to Hans and then left you forever. Kristoff? Loves me? Wow, you don't know anything about love, do you? No. Say, being inside is kind of warmer than being outside, huh? Olaf, you're melting. That's all right. Some people are worth melting for. Just maybe not right this minute. Now, come on, we've got to go find Kristoff. He's the only one who can save you. Greetings, good citizens of Arendelle. Princess Anna is dead. She was killed by Queen Elsa. At least we got to say our marriage vows before she died in my arms. That means you're in charge now, Prince Hans. Please, save us from this monster. Bring in the queen. I charge Queen Elsa of Arendelle with treason and sentence her to death. What? No! And the storm raged on and they were ravaged by the wrath of snow and the wind blew fear that the storm would grow. Colder by the minute, colder by the minute Elsa, I swear I'll find you! <laughs>
Kristoff, are you out there? Anna! Can't run, can't stop, can't breathe, can't live, and I can't die. Elsa, listen! Can't hope to fix this mess, yet somehow still I have to try. Please surrender! Feel, don't feel, don't feel! Get back into the cave! End this winter! And the storm raged on! frozen heart. It was too late to save her. Your sister is dead because of you. No! frozen heart around here is yours. Slay! 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 Is everyone all right? We are, Your Majesty. Rest assured. And may I be the first to extend my sincerest apology. Thank you. There's so much I've longed to say. Say it all beginning with today. It's like a dream I thought could never be. Elsa, you're free. Let it go. Let it go. Show us what you can do. Let it go. Let, Let it go.
is a shop. You want to come up? You want to stay down? You tell me. Okay. This one works. Wow. Can I take this off? That was so incredible. I am so, so blown away. I have to tell you, this was the first time I saw Frozen. <laughs> so it was really incredible. <laughs> um, so I've learned Frozen is about celebrating your gifts and bringing them forth to elevate others. And we are so grateful to you all for bringing your gifts to elevate this night, to elevate our program to bring back a musical in person to Milton. We are also grateful to our incredible parent volunteers who served as directors, music director, artistic director, producer, choreographer, costumer, everything. Let me speak specifically to thank Sarah, Sarah, Miriam, Marcy, Devorah, Lorian, Nina, and Karen, thank you so much. We have flowers for all of you. I'm glad that you mentioned missing them, and I'm really glad that we can bring those back too. As you also saw, Frozen is about the power of true bonds, of connection and love, and how they can bring us together and create something strong and enduring. And we see this with our students in middle school who've come together to create and contribute. Last week was amazing in the ways you did it, and today you showed what it looks like on stage. You came together through all these weeks of preparation, and you created bonds across grades and with each other that will endure even to our eighth graders long after you graduate, which is later this week, believe it or not. <laughs> So with deep appreciation to all who helped bring in an in-person musical back to our school, the first since 2019, we are so, so grateful for today. And I want to specifically thank Sarah Gershman and Sarah Shapiro. In 2017, 2017 when we started our middle school, they started the musical program in our middle school and have contributed to running a, mu a musical each year, even through the pandemic. We are forever grateful to the impact you've had on our school and on our students. Seeing them shine on stage, these moments will last with them forever, and you gave them that. Thank you so much. <laughs> So thank you very much. I think we're going to...